breaking in a new pair of Doc Martens in less than a week can be challenging, but there are several tips that can help you expedite the process. So today, I'm gonna show you some ways to break into your Doc Martens quickly. The first way is the quickest way to break into a pair of Doc Martens. This is by buying the right one. Doc Martens offer different types of leather, but each of them takes different periods of time to break into. If you wanna break into a pair of Doc Martens as quick as possible, I definitely recommend buying soft leather Doc Martens or some vegan Docs. The smooth leather Doc Martens are one of the hardest Doc Martens to break into. But on the other end, as the name implies, the soft leather is softer and makes it 10 times easier to break into. They fit like any other Docs, but they're just super soft. The soft leather Doc Martens to get are the Napper leather, the Virginia leather, or the Piso leather. You can break into these in about two, maybe three days. And if you're very ambitious, you can probably break it in your first try. When it comes to the vegan docks, they're made with synthetic material. So you don't have to worry about breaking into anything because it's not leather. The only thing to keep in mind with vegan docks is they're a little bit narrow, but as soon as you put them on, they're very easy to break into. What if you don't want none of those and you want a pair of smooth leather and you want to break into them as quick as possible. So, this is what you need to do. Once you get those pair of Doc Martens, the first thing you need to do is use leather conditioner or softener. The reason being is it helps moisturize the leather and it makes it more flexible. All you have to do is apply a small amount of conditioner on your boots and rub it into the leather. You can also use leather oil or balm to help protect the leather. The second thing to do is apply heat. I don't recommend using a hair dryer because it can get very confusing. There are so many different types of hair dryers, so many different types of levels, and I don't want you to destroy your Doc Martens. What I recommend is using a heater. Generally, heat up a small room, and then you leave your Doc Martens in there for about 10 to 15 minutes. This will soften the leather and make it more pliable allowing your boots to mold into the shape of your feet more quickly. You can also take some time to massage the boots on key sensitive areas like the back of the heels or around the toe box. Lastly, if you're going to use a hair dryer, just make sure you move the hair dryer around and avoid overheating the leather. Please do not damage your Doc Martens. The next thing is to wear thick socks. For the first couple of times wearing your Docs, please wear thick socks or you can double socks. It'll provide a cushion for your feet and protect them from rubbing or getting any blisters that may occur in the breaking in period. Next is wear your boots as much as possible. The more you wear them, the more quickly they will break in. Start by wearing them for short periods of time and gradually increase the duration. You can wear them around the house, to run errands, or to work. Try to build up to a thousand steps a day in your docks. But also keep in mind, if your feet start to hurt, please take them off and rest for the day. You don't want your feet to hurt. The last thing to do with your docks to break into them as quickly as possible is to stuff your docks. So when you're not wearing your docks, you'll want to stuff them with newspapers or if you have a shoe tree or anything like that, that's also a good thing to stuff your Doc Martens with. This will make the boots hold its shape when you're now wearing it, so once you put them on, they fit perfectly. Just remember, breaking into a new pair of Doc Martens can take some time and patience, but it's definitely possible to break into them in a week. Be gentle with your boots and take care of your feet to ensure a comfortable and successful breaking in experience.